There really is something special about scientific evidence. Science works, planes fly, magic carpets and broomsticks don't. Gravity is not a version of the truth, it is the truth. Anybody who doubts it is invited to jump out of a 10th floor window. So you want to be a gangster? All that shit. Smoke any motherfucker, don't even trip. You own the problem, not the offender. And as Stephen Fry, which I learned from you, once said, you know, oh, I hear I've offended you. What did he say? Uh, you can use the words. Well, what did he say? Um, oh, well, you're, you're offended. Well, so fucking what, is what he said. I wanted you to say it, not me. If you base medicine on, on science, you cure people. If you base the design of planes on science, they fly. Um, if you base the design of rockets on science, they reach the moon. It works, bitches. First, but then he's pooped. I mean, how, how can we have the same brain? I'm sorry to say we don't have the same brain. I mean, there's, there's a don't. great variation. One of the main principles of the Darwinian theory is plenty of variation for natural selection to work on. And there's, sure enough, very, plenty of variation in brain power. All the, way, all the way from Einstein on the one hand to Sarah Palin at the other. I got 99 pounds, but a bitch ain't one. I got the rat patrol on the cat patrol. Foes that want to make sure my cat... Is... To accept that humans evolved from apes. Yeah, probably. From Neanderthals, yes. Whether... Okay. From Neanderthals? Probably. Why from Neanderthals? Well, why, who, else, who else would you suggest? <laughs> Regulators. We regulate any stealing of his property. We're damn good, too. Our philosophy at New Scientist is this. Science is interesting, and if you don't agree, you can fuck off. <laughs> and then, and, and the present is, uh, is out at the tip of your fingers. Um, and it's, it, it's all bacteria out to about there. Uh, and the dinosaurs are about there. Um, and um, human fossils, but people like Lucy, come at, at about the, where you're the tip of your, near the tip of your fingernail. And the whole of human history, recorded human history, the, the Egyptians, the Babylonians, the Hebrews, the Romans, the Greeks, uh, the Middle Ages, the whole of recorded human history falls as the dust from one stroke of the nail file. Having looked at a lot of your work, I'm curious, uh, what star sign are you? Are you serious? Six million ways to die, choose one. Do you actually believe in your Muslim faith? Do you believe that Muhammad split the moon in two? Do you believe that Muhammad flew to heaven on a winged horse, for example? I, I pay you the compliment of assuming that you, that you don't. No, I do. I believe in miracles. You believe that? Yes. You believe that Muhammad went to heaven on a winged horse? Yes, I believe in God. I believe in miracles. I believe in revelation. I mean, the point here is that let's assume I'm wrong, Richard. I'm yeah, wrong. let's. Uh, you've, you've done debates all around the world. Have you ever had a, I guess, a clever or a interesting argument from the other side? No. <laughs> <laughs> Is the penalty for apostasy? And, well, um, 
Before yeah, we well, keep coming down this apostle, well, give, us, give, us, let, give, let, us, give us a quick answer if, if on if what was, is the penalty for apostasy. Country, 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 you sorry? very well know. If it's an Islamic country, then the Sharia is very clear. Apostasy, apostasy is dealt with the death penalty. Thank you. That's all well, I well, want well, to You do not believe in the existence of God, but you believe in aliens. But the very existence of your animosity, hatred, and mockery towards Him proves your hypocrisy. I suggest that you find the longest crowbar you can find to pull your head out of your behind. <laughs> when you say faith is rational and evidence-based, I mean, if that were true, it wouldn't need to be faith, would it? I mean, if, the, if there were evidence for it, uh, why would you need to call it faith? You'd say just evidence. And when you said that, we, that, that faith in relativity, in, in Einstein's theory of of re relativity is, is evidence-based. That, of course, it is. But, um, the, but the evidence is, is all important. I mean, Einstein's predictions fit in with, um, with uh, uh, observed fact and, they, and with a whole body of theory. Whereas we only need to use the word faith when there isn't any evidence. I presume you've got faith in your wife. Is there any evidence for that? On yes, which plenty. You base it? yes, plenty of evidence. Um, mm. I... <laughs> Let's generalize it. Never mind about my wife. Let's generalize it. <laughs> it's the same with Biden, Richard. It's the same with Biden. Because atheism is a faith, of course, as well. It's not. Of it, course it, it is. <laughs> Don't you believe it? <laughs> I, I... Bullshit dogma. <laughs> I read your book about the Bible. It is totally sucks ass <laughs> and is biased and one-sided propaganda. Your theory sucks. You are not as wise as you think you are. You hypocrites want to condemn anybody for making mistakes or believing different from your bullshit, retard, atheism <laughs> dogma. <laughs> Hawking's books are fucking stupid bullshit. <laughs> Would the world be a better place if religion disappeared tomorrow? Uh, yes. Uh, Despite all the good things we discussed that yeah. you recognise. <laughs> do you believe in the virgin birth, Christina? I do, I do. Mm -hmm. I believe in miracles too. Mm. Do you what do you think about this, well, I don't know about the virgin birth or not? Do you think that's key to being a Christian? Do you think all those sort of fundamental it's, key... It's, it's up to them. What they, if they want to believe supernatural nonsense, that is up to them. But don't force it on the rest of us. I was watching an interesting video. And again, if any of this you don't want to talk about, push us along. But there was a video with this woman, Wendy Wright. Um, and um, I found it very interesting to watch because... I saw you making all the good arguments, but a good argument will never make headway if the participants don't agree to certain basic rules of engagement. Yeah, yeah. And I just, at some point, I was wondering if it was fighting a just losing battle. And, and so did you find that satisfying, that conversation with Of her? course not, no. Um, uh, um, but in a way, I mean, she was... Pur purporting to be playing by the same rules because what she kept saying was, show me the evidence, show me the evidence. Right. Um, right. Uh, um, and, and, um... But, well, what, uh, what I'd prefer to say is that um, natural selection is constantly working and is, uh, the environment is constantly changing, um, if only because the, the predators, the enemies, the parasites uh, of any particular species are also evolving. And so you never really reach a sort of finished, settled optimum um, there's always more improvement that, that, that can happen. What about other parts of the body, which to me, I mean, as I say, just as a layman, um, I had to come to terms with, you know, how on earth did we function? And uh, the heart, for example, the lungs, the liver, the kidneys, uh, and particularly, don't want to be too personal, but how do I take a leak if I have to wake up a few million years to do that? Wait a minute, I don't understand. <laughs> well, if I was to go to the toilet, you know, yes. I mean, how, did, how did we evolve uh, with the ability to uh, release uh, waste if we were waiting for certain organs to develop? Well, no, it's, it's not really like that. Um, I know it's a simple question, but, uh, but well, I'm a simple man. I mean, you don't, you don't wait millions of years. It, 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 it all happens. There's a, there's a 